alive. I'll move out. You're now the new leader. And it was his way of making a public resignation. Even though Frank had retired from the mob, Genovese was still suspicious of him and his closest ally and street muscle, Albert Anastasia. On October 25, 1957, at the Park Sheridan Hotel, as Anastasia leaned back in a barber's chair for his morning shave, Beto's henchmen gunned him down. Back at the Majestic, Costello's attorney found his client with Anastasia's brother. They were sobbing. Costello said, this means I'm next. Before that could happen, a court reaffirmed Costello's conviction for tax evasion. The prime minister was shipped back to prison to finish out his sentence. 